for any aircraft to fly around. It uses some basic control surfaces, like you can see these moving parts uh, on an aircraft to go around in the air. The drawback is every time these things move, uh, they are going to create some air friction that is called drag uh, in technical terms. So, so every time that drag is created, we are losing flight time, using more power to you know overcome that uh, drag. So the idea was to come up with an alternative mechanism. You know, there are two uh, masses, one on the left wing and one on the right wing. So when I'm trying to turn left, this is going to extend towards the tip of the wing. And once, of course, the weight is moving towards the extreme end, it is going to create a gravitational force on this side. So if this is how it dips. And once the wing is dipping, we continue our pull and complete the turn. So that means your flight time is going to increase and the amount of fuel you are going to expend is going to reduce. So your range, endurance and everything are going to increase. So you can keep the aircraft much, much longer time in the air. And that is the point of a UAV. UAV does all that surveillance and uh, imaging and all this stuff. It needs to be in the air as long as possible to give all that data down. So the more time we give it in the air, the better it is.